in the lord day we must have this last message also because our lord jesus himself said in John chapter 4 when he was tempted by the devil Matthew 4 4 and he answered and said it is written man shall not live by bread alone but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God so we will live by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of God which is the Bible. I'll tell you a story. There was a very good uh, hunter. And uh, one day he was in the jungle and he saw a peculiar sight. In the jungle, yeah. He saw a peculiar sight. He saw something. Uh, there was a small snake and uh, was coming and biting some uh, leaves. Then uh, he was going behind the bush. Again he was coming back and again biting the leaf. So he went on seeing that. Then he thought to do something. So he removed that plant when that small snake we went behind the bush and then again that snake came and started looking for that plant and uh, could not find the plant so slowly that small snake started rolling and after some time that snake died. Then this uh, hunter came to know what happened. He went behind the bush. There was a big snake sitting there. And that big snake was uh, stinging him. And to take away that sting, that poison, that snake was coming near the leaf and eating that. When the leaf was taken away, that small snake died. So, beloved, we learned a very good lesson from here. That leaf can be considered as the as the pages of the word of God. We are every time poisoned by the word. The big snake, Satan, is always trying to put the poison of sin in us. So how can we live? As our Lord said, man shall live not by bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of God. So when there is a assembly anywhere, <laughs> there is this pattern always followed. First there is worship message, then worship, then little warning for the table, and then there should be a main message. So that we are able to give some bread of life to the believer. So we are doing this most of the places we do this some places because uh, 
they have lack of time they do two messages and uh, they have combined lord's table and main message that is also that is also not wrong because in the message we are given much warning but, but if possible we must have these three different messages so, we are going to see few things very quickly from first Thessalonians chapter 1 here we are going to see example of a true church yeah. the church at Thessalony was a exemplary church so we are not going to go very deep because as, po- as far as possible we want to finish at one o'clock because I know you all also have come from far away you want to go so, and you are God's people you will understand so seven things are here so let us read this first chapter carefully first Thessalonians chapter 1 we give thanks to God always for you all making mention of you in our prayer. Amra Parmesan Pita ko samne tvil ka vishwas ko kam aprem polisam ra hamra pravesh sukhisma bhai ko aasa ko dhiras nirantar samjhara karda chau. Knowing brother beloved your direction of your Lord and Savior. Kine ki hamro matra hoi na tar samarthya ma pavitra atma ma ra khubai nishayta sita timir ka aayeko thiyo. And he became followers of us and the Lord, having pleased the Lord in much affliction and with joy of the Holy Ghost. For from you sounded out the word of the Lord not only in Macedonia and Achaia but also in every place your faith to God will spread abroad so that we need not to speak anything. Then one more verse, the third chapter, and verse 8. Yeah, third chapter, verse 8, together. For now we live, we stand fast in the Lord. And chapter 5, and verse 5. Yeah. We are all the children of light and the children of day. We are not of the night nor of darkness. Shall we pray? प्रेमी पिता धन्यवाद देते हैं तूने हमें अद्भुत समय दिया तेरी उपासना धन्यवाद स्तुति हम कर सके और प्रभु तूने हमें मेज में से भी भाग लेने के लिए सहायता किया और प्रभु जी तेरे वचन के द्वारा समझाया प्रभु की मेज हमारे लिए कितनी आवश्यक है इम्पोर्टेंट अब प्रभु जी तेरे वचन को हम थोड़ी देर मनन करना मांगते हैं तो हमारी सहायता कर समय छोटा है पर पवित्र आत्मा परमेश्वर ये थोड़े समय में प्रभु तेरे गहरे विचार को तू हमारे सामने प्रकट कर दे तो प्रभु जी दूसरा शामिल तेईस एक और दो हम क्लेम करते हैं जहाँ दाऊद ने कहा था मेरे हृदय में परमेश्वर का आत्मा था और मेरे मुंह में परमेश्वर का वचन प्रभु जी यही हम भी चाहते हैं और समझने के लिए लू का चौबीस पैतालीस को हम क्लेम करते हैं धन्यवाद देते इस समय के लिए इस प्रार्थना को प्रभु यीशु के नाम से चढ़ाते हैं सुन और ग्रहण कर टू द चर्च एट थेलोनी 
Paul gave this uh, uh, encouraging word. In chapter 5, verse 5, he says, Ye are all the children of light. This was a wonderful compliment. The church in Thessaloni was a church from where the light was being seen. So why this church was called as the lighthouse? How can a place become the lighthouse or place where where people can see the light. So how should be a true church? So, quickly we are going to see seven things. Firstly, in First Thessalonians chapter 1 and verse 1, yeah, he says, Paul and Silvanus and Timotheus unto the church of the Thessalonians which is in God the Father and in the Lord Jesus Christ. This is, this is the first criteria for true church. God's people are in God the Father in Lord Jesus Christ. This is the plan of God. Even to the children of Israel, the Lord brought them out of Egypt and took them into the promised land. So, Lord just, just did not bring them out. Yeah, many people in the world only are left with this first step. They have salvation, but they do not have the experience of going inside Christ. Yeah, if we are inside Christ, then we will not be seen. And we will not desire that we should be seen. Only Christ should be seen from my life. That's why the work is done by the Holy Spirit. So when uh, the Lord does His work, there are four redemptive work done by the Holy Spirit. First is the baptism of the Holy Spirit. Yeah, which, which people of this world, especially the denominational people did, don't understand. Because we meet to Matthew chapter 3. And here it is told baptism of the Holy Spirit. Verse 11. Uh, I indeed baptize you with water unto repentance. But he that cometh after me is mightier than I. Whose shoe I am not worthy to bear. He shall baptize you with the Holy Ghost and with fire. Listen carefully, this is a very important doctrine for a believer. When we accept Lord Jesus Christ, we do not see with our eyes. But in the unseen realm, the Holy Spirit will take us and bring us inside Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, that is real baptism. It means being totally immersed or submerged. So we are, we are brought inside Christ. So this is the first thing 
or we can say the relation is made. Yeah, baptism speaks of the relation being made. Then, then secondly, what the Holy Spirit will do? Second Corinthians and chapter 1. And verse 21. Now he that established us with you in Christ and hath anointed us in God. Uh, yeah, so second thing with the Holy Spirit does is the anointing. <laughs> in the olden times, uh, kings were anointed and priests were anointed. And same thing is told for us. In Revelation chapter 5 and verse 10, we are made kings and priests. Why he is making us king? Why can I As king rules, we must also rule. And secondly, as priests used to serve the Lord, in the same way we must serve the Lord. So the second thing is anointing of the Holy Spirit. So, baptism of the Holy Spirit, where we are brought into the relation, and secondly, anointing, we can say the, the relation is made firm. And the third is, in Ephesians chapter 1, and verse 16, yeah. What is it written? Ohamane, Ohamane, Timirli, Bishas Galipasi, Pratigia Kapoita, Mali, Timiru, Sap Madio. Sealed by the Holy Spirit. Apoita, Mother Sap Mari. This is like the work which God has done is now established. Now it cannot change. So sealing is put. And that sealing is the sealing of the blood. So when we will see with the spiritual eyes, everything looks red. Because the Holy Spirit will put that sealing by the blood of Jesus. Turn to Isaiah 27. I don't know in Nepali what it is written, but in English it is written, verse 2, In that day sing ye unto her a vineyard of red wine. So church is like vineyard. And how is this vineyard? It is the vineyard of red wine. So even Satan when he sees, he can see where the red is there. And where the red is not there. So beloved, that's why you must also come inside that ceiling. Otherwise Satan will try to attack you. Uh, he will know this one is not God. This is, this is mine. The ceiling is not upon him. And fourthly, according to Ephesians 5.18, there, there is the filling of the Holy Spirit. See, and be not drunk with wine where it is excess, but be filled with the Spirit. So this is the fourth thing done by the Holy Spirit. Feeling by the Holy Spirit. Now how can we be filled with by the Holy Spirit? By jumping, saying hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the 
बंद The Holy Spirit is a holy person. अरे पवित्र आत्मा नहीं चला पवित्र व्यक्ति हो. And when we allow him to fill, जब आमे उन्हें बाहर न लाएँ आमे अनुमति दें सो. Slowly, slowly he makes me also a holy person. अरे बिस्तार बिस्तार है उन्हें मलाई पनी ऐसे इड़ा पवित्र मानी समझाऊँ सर. Turn with me to John chapter 14. आमों सही तो बोलिए ना सो दे दें पढ़ानों. We read this verse before also. हम इधर पहले अपनी पद पढ़ेगा हम. Verse 23. हाँ तेईस पर. जॉन जॉन प्रेम करने ही ना। Supposing we have to go to visiting। राम ये श्री विजित में जानू पड़ने भाइयों। Then we will say, oh, we will have to go। हाँ, हमें जाने पड़ता है। बंचों। That becomes dutiful। अच्छे से डॉक्टर तेरे पास पूरा कर दिया। But if you go out of love, तब ये डॉक्टर प्रेम बात आप जानू भाई बंदी। Oh, I must go and see my brother। राम अगर मेरे भाई ले मेरे बेटे ही पड़ता है। I, 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 I know he is in problem। हमारे साथ तो उसे डॉक्टर समझ जाएँ। So that is called delightfully। तो इसे वह और सब लास्ट को साथ में। So we must love the Lord and obey. That is delightfully obeying the Lord। राम ये से प्रभु लाये प्रेम करने पर सार वह आगरण पालन करने पर सार। इसे तो मैं कि आज हर से खुशी रिदे ले। Then the word says। आने के बाद आपस में बचा। We will come and make our abode with him। राम ये हमें आ रहा उस समय से हम लोग बांसु स्थान बनाने। So this is the first Example or sign of a true church. Ara you see or a sachcha mandir ke da pailo or a udharano. The real church or true church is a saved church. Ara pa se sachcha mandir bari ko chahi or a bachaiye ko mandir. They have the experience of baptism of the Holy Spirit. Oner sa baptism koi ta atma ko se baptism koi. They have the experience of anointing of the Holy Spirit. Oner sa koi ta atma ko se abhishek koi nuvav sa. They have the experience of sealing of the Holy Spirit. Oner sa koi ta atma le chhap mari koi nuvav sa. They have the experience of filling of the Holy Spirit. Oner lai koi ta atma le so the Thessalonian church was like that. Are you Thessaloniki ko mandalis? Yes, sir. So Paul is saying, which is in God the Father, in the Lord Jesus Christ. Aya Paul bande se jo Parmeshwar ma ani Prabhu Yesu Masi ma. And in verse five. Aya pas par. In the Holy Ghost also it is written. Aya ani the aya poyi cha paam aur paam apni bande dekhiye sir. So we are totally inside our Lord. Aami sir, pura prarup ma Prabhu Vishnu sir. Secondly. Aya dosro jo. Yeah, verse six. Sapad. Yeah. This is the second example of a true church. Rasa mandali kosi orang itu sudah tahu. Anjuru kustma putra atma ko ananda saat basan brahman kari pesi. Dimi ru hamra ra aprobu ka dekha siki karni ru bayu. Dekha siki. Dekha siki. Which means this church is a surrendered church. Ah, the swar sa orang itu mandali si orang samad pit mandali. First of all, it is a saved church. Paling achi si orang bacaiu ko mandali. Secondly, it is a surrendered church. Ah, the swar si orang bacaiu ko mandali. Yo samad pit mandali. In English, it says, "He became followers of us and of the Lord." Ira, ti mula hamro ra prabhu ka dika si ki ganer bayu. So you were copying us. Ah, ti mula ya hamila pachareka tiyo. So this church also must copy. 
good church or good god's people ara yo mandali le pani ara asal mandali lai ta asal parmeshwar ka janar lai unle le nakal garnu parcha and also copy the lord ara prabhu ko nakal garnu parcha our life should speak ara hamro jivan le aaja bolnu parcha there was a, a very good artist ah ara asal ja chitrakar thiye i'm talking about olden times ah purana samay bisay ma batai dieko chu and he was moving in the european country ah one chese european desh haru ma bhraman garde thiye from one country to the other country there is only a border for, from the land ara ai dikha arko desh ma hai tesari jamin ko bhumi ka tera bhumi ko ma simana thiyo going by the car on a car bada yatra ni when he reached the border jab unhe sir it is simana ma pugi and he was asked for his passport ara us lai usko the passport ko raadha ni dimte ji when the passport when the passport was asked jab raadha ni ko bisay ma sodiyo and he started searching and he did not have a ule khojna khojna thale tar sa thiye na now what to do ab ke garna i don't have the passport mas sara the passport raadha ni thiye na he said to the officer ule officer la banyo i don't have the passport but you know i am artist al gor ara mo sanga che seri password che chaina ta ha tapai tha cha mo si artist al gor ye al gor mero mo si al gor was a very big artist ha u se era mahan chitrakar thi so the officer laugh ha officer ha se that type of thing many will say ha ole bhane testo pura pura ajhe dherai le bhanne garchan so you may say any name and you go get away ara tapai le kasa ko naam le tapai eura ukino hola bhanne bhanne no no i am al gor ha ole bhane mo hain na mo chai al gor hu then the officer said officer bhane i will bring one paper mo tin eura paper lyaunchu you are an artist e tin chitrakar ho bhane make a good drawing ha tin eura So he brought a paper. Ole sir, paper le. And Al Gore saw the scenery there. Ole Al Gore le sir adrishya dekhi. And that same scenery he started drawing on the paper. Ole the adrishya ji paper ma sir pran thare. And the officer saw saw that. Officer le tiyo dekhi. He proved that he was Al Gore. Ole the sir mo Al Gore hu manar sir le sir praman kare. That is how a believer should be. Ah, the sir ah, this the thing that I believe Swasti nuno par pasa. Paul is telling to the. Church at Thessaloni, <coughs> that you people have showed that you are true believers. Ra Paul is at Thessaloni ki ma bhai ka bishwas chale bande sun ki. Ti mere se saath toh bishwas ho bade mere praman diye ho. He became followers of us and of the law. Ra ti mere se hi hamro, ham hamra, ra prabhu ka dekha si ki. So this is the second example of a true church. Aye si asa saath toh mandali ko chahi. Ra dosu daar. First true church will be saved church. Ah pahle si pu ah saath toh mandali ko le si udhar mandali ko mandali. Secondly, true church will be surrendered church. अलग दोस्तों से ये रोज़ सांसों मंडली से रोज़ समर्पित मंडली नॉन परसों। In the same words, आरती पद्मा। Third point is also there. तीसरों को आप बुद्ध आपने चलाया नहीं था। And uh, having received the word in much affliction। यहाँ तेरे कष्ट माजी चुरो कष्ट माजी पर चार पाव आशे रे प्रभु बसन ग्रहण करेगा। This church went through lot of suffering। ये मंडली से तेरे प्रकार को कष्टों में बढ़ता है। So the third important example or sign of a true church is it will always be a suffering church। यहाँ आपको तीस रोची यहाँ महत्वपूर्ण उदाहरण ताव तीस को चिन्ह क्यों बंदा करी? यहाँ असल मंडली सांचो मंडली जली पनी कष्टों में बढ़ता है। When we take stand for the Lord, जब आये प्रभु को इसे आने तो हमें इसे अड़ान लेना हो। People will become our Opposition. अरे मानसिक रूप से हम लोग विरोधी होने चाहिए। Many times people don't want to take baptism. देरी पर मानसिक रूप से बक्तिस में लोगों सांदे नहीं। They say that when my mother or father will die, then I will take baptism. राम ने बंसल जब मेरे बाबा आवाज़ से मर्सन आने में तो मुझे बक्तिस में लेना चाहिए। Then then that is not true life. तेरे सांसों जीवन है ना? You have to go through difficulties. तब ऐसे से ये तो दुखा हमारे दानों पर चलो वहीं के आधी बेरी आए हैं। And when there was storm, जब तो आधी बेरी वहीं लगते हैं। And disciples were very much scared after it। अच्छे लारो अति ने भाई बिठवाए। And the Lord came and stood there। और आप लोग आए थे अभी नवा। And the Lord said, "It is I." और आप लोग बोलो यो माँ। He said, "This storm is I." और आप लोग बोलो यो सरी यो अजुना अजुना यो आधी बेरी से चुमा हूँ। Yeah, the Lord brings storm in our life। Probably आप लोग जीवन में आधी बेरी लाऊँ उनसे। What happened after that storm? तो आधी बेरी पसारी क्या बात है? The Lord walked on the water। Probably सरी पानी में धीनु भाई। And Peter also walked on the water। और पत्र से भी पानी में धीनु। This is what the Lord wants us to do. अरे कुछ आज प्रॉब्लम आमले को आसान होता है। So he takes us through sufferings। हमारे आमले से कस्टम भरे लान होता है। And when we go through sufferings, तो हमें कस्टम हर में भरे जाते हैं। There are many things which happen। आज ये तो आरोग्य से कहने लगा। Quickly, turn with me to First Peter chapter four। पहले पत्र सार दे। And verse four। 
When we go through sufferings, what happens? Yeah. Uh, Those who go through suffering, they are delivered from sin. So, because of that suffering, we start examining our life. So that's why we cease from that sin. Secondly, in uh, uh, Psalm chapter 4, uh, Psalm chapter 4 verse 1. Yeah, what happens when suffering comes? Uh, he made a darby taka permission, Maripuka da Mirapuka Sunhos, a double mock customer, a customer pay, Tavatapai Malay Brown Hill. When we suffer, we are enlarged. Uh, yeah, we, we are enlarged in our understanding. We are enlarged in our spiritual life. There is no suffering, there is no enlargement. Then in Psalm 66, and verse 2, uh, it says, Oh Lord, how can I enter your rest? They are enlarged. Now, this is the third blessing. Psalm 66 12. Hami Pani We are brought to wealthy place. That's why David was a Merciful King. People walked on his head. King Saul was troubling him. But through all that experience, he learned that he should be a merciful person. So when when his turn came, he was merciful. To Mafi so, so we become wealthy, spiritually wealthy people. One more, one more. Isaiah 61. And, and verse 7. When we go through sufferings, uh, what is this fourth blessing? Yeah. 61, 7. So when we go through sufferings, we receive double blessing. Yeah. So never despise when suffering comes on you, beloved. So, now we go to the fourth thing. Fourth exemplary thing about this Thessaloniki church. First, they were saved church. Second, they were surrendered church. Third, they were suffering church. Now, fourthly, seven and eight. Uh, was 
was spread abroad far away so that should be the true example of a church they were soul winning church through their lives they were influencing others yeah, this is so important today that is not happening Peter with me to Acts 17 where, where the work started in Thessaloniki and what was told verse 6 and when they had come Oh, these people who have turned the world upside down have come here. So, that should be the effect of the church. But today it is a sad thing. The world is influencing us. We are not influencing. In the world, people are, people are not talking about us. We should be the talk of the town. Talk of the town. Talk of the town, <laughs> town means people should say, Oh, these people, look at them, what they are doing. Yeah, but instead of that, we are getting all the things from the world. So, a true church will be a soul winning church. So, may the Lord help this Laharoi. That it may be a saved church. It may be a surrendered church. Maybe it is suffering church, but there is blessing. And fourthly, soul winning church. Fifthly, in verse 10 and to wait for his son from heaven then you Oh, Paul could even talk with this church about the second coming. In no other epistle Paul wrote like this. But in this epistle, in chapter 4, Paul is revealing one proof, what wonderful truth. He says that the, when the trumpet is blown, the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then then we who are alive will caught up. So, beloved, I believe this Thessalonian church were so much in love with the Lord, they were waiting eagerly for the coming of the Lord. So, they were waiting for the Lord. So, so the, the true church is always. A second coming church. True church is second coming church. Means they are always waiting for the second coming of the Lord. Then thirdly, then sixthly, I think Brother Gambir is tired. First uh, Thessalonians chapter 3 and verse 8. Yeah, I'm going to conclude very soon. I'm feeling hungry, I think. No. I'm okay. <laughs> You're all hungry. Yeah, verse 8. Oh, this is a wonderful verse here. If you stand. If you, he's Paul is saying, if you stand, believe, oh, when 
others stand for the lord jab aur se prabhu nimti govinchan then other god's people are also able to live aur prabhu ka sirf jan aur prabhu jivna sakcha this was the character of the thessalonian church raj yo chi thessalonika bhayeko mandali ko chi ra vishesta thiyo they were standing for the lord aur se prabhu ka nimti govinthe and this is the very difficult thing aur se ati ne gaharo kura ya when time comes we are not able to take stand ra samay jab aauncha ki hami sesari te obina sakdaino we 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 fall away हामी चाहिँ पछि हटेर जान्छौ वी ट्राई टु सेव आवर स्किन र आज हामीले चाहिँ हाम्रो यसरी जे हो त छाला जो गर्न चाहन्छौ इफ समबडी देयर समथिंग रंग कसैले यसरी के गल्ती गरे भन्दिकि देन वी आर नॉट रेडी टु गो एंड टेल दैट ब्रदर आ र हामी त्यो गरे त्यो भाइले गरे बताउ न हामी चाहिँ तत्पर हुँदैन वी से यु गो आ तपाई जानुस् न द अदर वी गो अनि अरु अरु जुन जान्छ आई डोंट वांट टु से एनीथिंग म उसलाई किन भन्छु आई वांट टु बी इन द गुड बुक्स अफ अदर र यसरी म चाहिँ अरु सेरियलको विषय पनि म राम्रो प्रश्न छ मेरो विषयमा अरु राम्रो भन्न चाहन्छु अ दैट्स ऑल त्यति नै मात्र हो सो वी डोंट वांट टु टेक स्टैंड र हामी यसरी त्यो अडान लिन चाहन्छ साधन नो जोसेफ टुक स्टैंड त हामीले थाहा छ युसुफले चाहिँ त्यो अडान लिए इन जेनेसिस 37 ही केम एंड टोल्ड इवल ऑफ हिज ब्रदर्स टु द फादर र यसरी उत्पत्ति सहित छ दैमा उनका भाइले गरेको खराबीको कुरा जुन बाबुले बताए एंड दैट्स व्हाई हिज ब्रदर्स बिकेम हिज एनिमी र त्यस कारण त भाइहरु चाहिँ कसरी शत्रु बने व्हेन वी विल टेक स्टैंड फॉर द लॉर्ड मेनी टाइम्स वी विल गेट मेनी एनिमीज र जब हामी प्रभु निम्ति अगाडि उभिन्छौ खडा हुन्छौ तब हामीलाई यसरी हाम्रो धेरै शत्रु पनि हुन्छन् जोशुआ एंड कालेब आल्सो स्टूड फॉर द लॉर्ड र योसु र कालेब पनि प्रभु निम्ति यसरी उभिए एंड दैट्स व्हाई दे वेर द ओन the two who entered the promised land around who began from egypt ra sa misra deswara shuru garne ro madhe ti dui matre unjo che sari pratigya garne ta sapuge and lastly ra ante ma chai the thessalonian church was a submissive church ra sari thessaloniki ko mandali che sari adhin ma basne mandali thiyo paul did not have to tell many things to them na unle ra dherai kura batai ranu paula avashyak chhaina like the church at corinth paul had to Uh, tell and describe so many things. There are many things we can learn from Paul. There are many things we can learn from Paul. That's why the letter is very short. I think I need to put that in a short way. This Thessalonian church, church epistle is very short. The Thessalonian church manual is a very short epistle. It's very short. In fourth and fifth chapter, there are five or six items. He's simply giving them orders. There are only like only these things that are certain things that are given because they were submissive. Now, when they were submissive, they were some adhin ma basne. For example. Read verse one. Ah, okay. Ah, chapter four, verse one. Ah, four. Look at that. On the meh bairo, how many men are there? Provision ma. Ah, the poor boy didn't get so. There are other things so. The men are there. Because they don't want to be there. Permission like who is part number six. So, the men are there. The men are there. He is saying walk to please God. Ah, say permission like person not to go. So, Paul was knowing that they were submissive. Now, Paul was thought that they were very adhin ma pasni. That's why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why he is giving them very short command. Ah, that is why हाथ भन्दा बढी आफ्नो भाइले नठगोस या सो डिफ्रॉड नॉट योर ब्रदर आफ्नो भाइले कसैले नठगोस एन्ड देन वर्स 9 आ नो पदमा तर भाइ भाइको प्रेमको विषयमा मैले तिमीलाई लेख्छु आ लेख्नु तिम्रो लागि खाँचो छैन किनकि एउटा अर्कोलाई प्रेम गर्नुपर्छ भने तिम्रो आफैले परमेश्वरद्वारा शिक्षा पाइन्छ दे ऑलरेडी वेर हैविंग चैरिटी और लव फॉर द ब्रदर र सही भाइ भाइमा अघि उनीहरुसँग त्यो प्रेम छ नि थियो दिस दिस चर्च वाज सबमिसिव चर्च ऑलवेज रेडी टू obey to every command which came from the servants of god yo mandali chi yo adin ta bhayeko mandali thiyo ani yesari prabhu das le bhayeko ra chhe unero manna lai tayar thiyo may the lord help laharoi also to be such a chair ra parmeshwar le yo mandali laharoi lai pani yesari yesto prakar ko mandali huna saitha garika hu saved church ara udhar mukti bhayeko mandali surrender church samarpit mandali and blessed because of suffering ara yesari dukha kushta kashta bhare gai dwara bata aashish bhayeko mandali soul winning church yesari aatma ro jitne mandali church which is waiting for the second coming ara to mandali jasle se prabhu ko sari dosro aagman ko baat gerdai basha church which is standing for the lord ara to mandali jasle prabhu ko paksha ma bhai ubin cha and church which is obedient to everything which is told to do ara to mandali jasle hari kura aage garincha tyo mannak lai tayar bhai mandali may the lord help us ara prabhu le sath gari kaam tell me please i pray for you
हुन्छ हाम्रो वचन रक्षक लागि हाम्रो भाइ पदमले प्रार्थना गरिदिनुस् छुटकारीमा छुटकारीमा है असल मंडली को संबंध में तब परमेश्वर आपने दास में भाई कला हमें सुना बोल भाई कि तब परमेश्वर ने मनों चा मानी इस बोझ ने मात्र बास्ते ही ना तब परमेश्वर मुख पर निश्चरी बच्चे ने बास्ता चा साची नहीं आज जो तब परमेश्वर की स्थापन कर रहे भाई को नया मंडली में हमें सवाई की भाई कला प्रभु हमें ले तपाईं को तपाईं बाट अपने भोजन हमें ले प्रभु पावने सोमा की हमें ले पाई का छाऊ र अशल चर्च को बुर कस्टोनो तो होता चाह बनी कर तपाईं पर मिशन ने आपने दास भाई का नाम शंग बताऊं न भयो इब्ता पर मिशन तपाईं ले धन्यवाद इन्चाऊ जति बच्चनोर आए को चाह प्रभु सभी बच्चन को 